In 1998, Texas Instruments introduced the TI-89 graphing calculator. It was a more compact version of the TI-92, which was released three years prior. In 2004, the TI-89 received an upgrade in the form of the TI-89 Titanium. It featured three times the amount of memory, a mini USB port instead of the proprietary Silverlink port, and a more rounded case design. While the TI-89 series was way more powerful than the TI-84, the TI-84 was more popular and more widespread in schools. The TI-89 is still produced to this day, however, it no longer receives software updates and has been largely replaced by the TI Inspire series. Unlike most modern graphing calculators, the TI-89 is powered by four AAA batteries. This makes the calculator quite thick and heavy. However, it is built with premium materials, which makes the calculator feel solid in your hands. It also features a very different button layout to navigate a very different user interface. This user interface is filled with a menu system, an app system, and a home app which requires you to enter it just to do 2 plus 2. I find this user interface somewhat confusing, but once you get over the learning curve, it begins to feel quite natural. Another issue with the user interface worth noting is that many of the functions are locked behind the catalog menu. This is because the calculator has a unique choice of buttons which means that some functions, such as log and nth root, don't have designated keyboard shortcuts on the calculator. Thankfully, Texas Instruments has released some software updates which allow additional keyboard shortcuts for those hidden functions. This makes navigating the calculator a lot easier. Now, let's talk about the biggest feature of the TI-89, CAS. CAS is a computer algebra system which was introduced on the TI-92 in 1995. It can solve any algebra question, including differentials, and is very easy to use. Some of the most useful functions include solve, insolve, desolve, and factor. Unfortunately, the ACT test won't let you use CAS calculator. This is why, when CAS made its way over to the TI Inspire series, they made sure to release a non-CAS variant as well. In terms of programming, the TI-89 Titanium is pretty basic. See what I did there? It lets you code TI basic functions and standalone programs, and you can export and import these to the calculator using the TI Connect software. All in all, the TI-89 Titanium was a very unique calculator and I think it was ahead of its time with features like CAS, document saving, and a confusing menu system, but one that's extremely powerful. Unfortunately, TI will probably discontinue it soon as it's been around for over 15 years. I hope you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you want to.